So if you have been using Excel for data analysis, you must already be a fan of pivot table. Using pivot tables, we can actually analyze our data very easily by just deploying a pivot table and then dragging down our fields into the pivot table. So for example, here we need to analyze our sales over different years for different countries. So you can see very quickly, I have split my sales into three different years separately for each specific country. And I can actually filter down any category very easily just by dropping the category here into the filters, then selecting the category. So now you can see I am only looking at the sales for my clothing line for all different years. You need to change that? No problem. So let us say we need to not separate the data for different years. We can remove that from here. And now you can you are seeing the sales for all the clothing for different years separately for each country. Similarly, if you like to split your sales for each country by category, all you need to do is to remove the category from filters and take it to the columns. And now you can see you have your sales for each category. So pivot table basically help you analyze your data very easily in Excel. And now the big question is how we can use pivot tables in Power BI. And this is actually very easy. Once you are in your Power BI, you're, you have your data in Power BI. All you need to do is to move to the report view. And in this report view, from this visualization pane, you need to deploy a matrix. Once you deploy the matrix, you will have these options of rows, columns and values. Now let us say we need to analyze our sales. We will drop that to the values part and we want to analyze the sales separately for each country. So we will deploy the rows here, country here into the rows. And now let us say we want to split the sales into three different years. We will deploy that here into the year. So you can see you are able to analyze the data in very similar way here using the pivot table approach. You need to filter down the data for category, no problem. All you need to do is to deploy a slicer here and in that slicer you will drop your category and once you do that you can see you can filter down your data for any specific category by just a click. So just like pivot tables you can use all that functionality in Power BI as well. You need to change that? No problem. So for example, if we like to change this pivot table here and we need to remove the ears and bring the category, we will just bring that here and remove the ear. And now you can see you have your category appearing here. Since we have applied the slicer of food, you are only seeing one specific row here. But if I remove this slicer, you can see you have your data for each specific category in a column split for each year into the rows. So I hope that you have really loved seeing pivot tables in your Power BI.